Let us understand behavior from a biological perspective. The 19th century is when William James gave the first workable definition for psychology, that is, the science of mental life attempting to understand the cognitive, emotional and motivational process that underline human experience, thought and action. This provided a path for the different schools of psychology to explore the field in depth. One of the prominent schools of psychology is functionalism or school of psychology that focused on how the mind works and what it does. This allowed the newly emerging field to focus on the structure and function of the brain and how it affects our behavior. Though functionalism was later rejected, it allowed for further growth and development, leading way for a new school of thought that is biopsychology, the study of physiology and biological processes to understand human behavior. This field of psychology is often referred to as biopsychology or physiological psychology. This branch of psychology has grown tremendously in recent years and is linked to other areas of science including biology, neurology and genetics. The biological perspective is essentially a way of looking at human problems and actions. The study of physiology and biological processes has played a significant role in psychology since its earliest beginnings. Charles Darwin first introduced the idea that evolution and genetics play a role in human behavior. Biopsychology studies how biological processes influence the mind and behavior. This area is closely linked to neuroscience and utilizes tools such as MRI and PET scans to look at brain injury or brain abnormalities.